it here in the book, but you can't see it in reality. In other words, you can locate a scripture verse. And that's what a lot of people do and call it the revelation. That's not the revelation. Because when you see it, you don't try to behave like it happened already. When you ain't seeing it, even though you're meeting it, you're bouncing in there, you're up and down, you come back in the prayer line like John Ryan, over and over, back in the prayer line like John Ryan, over and over. Until you see it and you catch it, no more prayer line, no more prayer line. Hallelujah! It's like, praise the Lord, I'm healed. Praise the Lord, I'm well. Praise the Lord, I'm delivered. Praise the Lord, I'm walking in it. Praise the Lord, he's faithful, he'll give it to me. Praise the Lord, it's impossible for him to lie. Praise the Lord, he's the author and finish of my faith. Praise the Lord, he never give up on letting me start. He's still walking in me. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory be to God in the house. Oh, let's give him some praise inside of here. This great mighty God, this kingdom with demon and blessed one who is here amongst us. He not fought the miles in his flag staff in Arizona. He is in a bad country. Hallelujah. You better believe it. He's in a bad country. Yes, sir. Can't you see Christ being revealed in his own world? Can't you see Christ in the mystery of God being revealed? Can't you see? One take the book and eat the book. Can't you see the prophecy going forth? Oh, hallelujah. If I didn't take that book, there's no redemption for nobody in this church. You know that? If I didn't take that book and eat that book, I have nothing to tell you. Everything I tell you will keep you in the wilderness. It will keep you in bondage. But if I eat that book, I can minister the blessing. I can get such as I have. Give I unto you. Oh my. When that strike you, you know that's the information. That revelation. It gives prevailing power to pull them the stronghold. Put that depression and oppression under your feet. Sin, go under my feet. Backbiting, under my feet. Dog and fear, under my feet. Lust, adultery and fornication, under my feet. Homosexuality, under my feet. Oh, hallelujah. Glory. Discover. The greatest discovery is not the internet. No, 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 no. We have a channel of communication far greater than that. Hallelujah. The greatest discovery is to discover the kinsman. Is to discover he lives. Is to discover he's interested. Is to discover he's present. Is to discover everything it takes to put you in the rapture. He is there. Taking the future hope. He's there. Boy, say, I will finish the thing. As the Lord lives, that he swear. I swear to He just fear not root. No more fear. Now he says, set still. Oh, thank you, Lord. Oh, blessed assurance. Blessed assurance. He's imparting blessed assurance. Hallelujah. Glory. Oh, let's stand and praise God. Amen. Praise this mighty God. Glory. Let the musicians come. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 He is guiding your footsteps. He died in your footsteps. Hallelujah. Glory. Glory. Hallelujah. You're not hopeless this morning. There is hope. There is expectation. Hallelujah. 
We find out who Boaz is. He's not that charitable man. He's not that. This is the man who is to put you back in the garden of Eden with full dominion. This is the man to bring you back in the image. We have found the man between the six and seven trumpets. We have found the man in the days after the chief reaper. We are in the man presence. We have spoken with the man. We are linked with the man. We are under the headship. We have the unfailing words of promise of the man. This man, Revelation 10:1, the greater Boaz from the tribe of Judah, born in Bethlehem. This one who can with the second seven trumpet. This one after now is in the homeland. Appear to the chief reaper. Glory! He is my everything. He is my holy Lord. This one is giving blessed assurance this morning. This one is imparting grace. He might start you off with a little food. He might start you with some blessings. He might open the mystery of the parched corn and the bread dip in the vinegar, the strong wine. When you come to your water baptism and your communion. But he's walking away. And when he finished, he take it to his future home. Fully redeemed. Nobody has no claim on you. You are all his and he's all yours. You are all his and he's all yours. Hallelujah! Outside of this discovery, the greatest discovery in the 20th and 21st century, that man says to discover the world. What a discover can't take them back to Eden. But this discovery is taking you back. The goer, the, kid, the near kinsman, the one who comes to our rescue. Hallelujah! You have to have three things. You have to be related by blood. That's why he became flesh. That's why he shed his blood. To make a way to give us a new birth. That his life can come back into us. This one is able. And not only able. He's able to do the exceedingly abundantly. Above all you can ask or think. You talk about wealth. He is able. Get your heart and mind. So in tune. With the Holy Spirit that is present. Get your heart so open. That you can see so clear. What the Spirit is saying to the church this morning. This one. It might be your hap to light on this field that brought you into the presence of Boaz this morning. And the few handfuls that have fallen to you that make something stir with inside of you. Something moved over you. The dove flew into your heart. Lift you above the storms.